All right, guys, welcome back to another one. We're in the shop today trying to build an old school duck call. Let's get to it. Right, guys I've already cut my 5 8 hole I've got it trued up so it's round as you saw I started square right now I'm just cutting the piece for the band All right now I've got a bit of a dilemma when I was cutting the 5 8 hole the wood got so hot from the friction of the drill bit that it cracked up here I'm hoping it doesn't crack all the way down. I can still get away by shortening the call. Perfect. Alright guys, so it appears that crack only went in about uh, a quarter of an inch, so I was able to get rid of that piece. And here we are, so this is where the band's going to go, and your lanyard, and a little bit of an old school rake to the back here. Nothing left to do now but sand this up and try and make it look pretty. It's got to be tight. See how we did. That's our copper ring. Oh, fits. You see? I need that to be a little tighter. I can make it work. We glue these on anyways, but still. All right, so there you have it. A little bit of an old school look. That's exactly what I was going for. I made another one of these, and I uh, tried to duplicate as best I could, but uh, I think it turned out pretty good. Now what I'll do is I'll glue that copper band on, and then I'll put it back on the lathe and shine it up, put an insert in it, and away we go. And by the way, I'll oil these. I won't put any shellac or, or any uh, varnish or anything on these or and I won't put any stain on them either. It's just a natural. I'm going to put the oil on it. I'm going to wax the inside so that the moisture from your mouth doesn't rot the wood from the inside. There you have it. Anyway, that's all I got for this video. I hope you all enjoyed that. Thank you all for hitting that subscribe button while you're here. I appreciate it very much. And as always, don't forget to enjoy the outdoors. Thank you.